Brazil's history is rich in tales of heroes and revolutionaries, but few names echo through the ages with as much force as Joaquim José da Silva Xavier, known to all as Tiradentes. His life is made up of many chapters, such as his rise as a revolutionary, his tragic fall and the lasting legacy that turned him into a national hero. Tiradentes was born on November 12, 1746, at Fazenda do Pombal in Minas Gerais. His early years were marked by difficulties. He was the fourth of seven children in a family that was struggling to survive. The early death of both parents forced young Joaquim into a life of work and adaptation. The Silva Xavier family fell into debt and ended up losing their land. With no formal education, Tiradentes learned various trades from his uncle, such as dentistry, and earned the nickname Tiradentes. As a young man, Tiradentes worked as a miner and merchant, and eventually joined the Minas Gerais Dragoon Regiment. Despite his service, he never rose above the rank of ensign, which led to even greater dissatisfaction. During his travels, Tiradentes became acquainted with new ideas from the American Revolution and other places. Influenced by these concepts, and outraged by Brazil's precarious economic situation under Portuguese rule, he began to dream of a free and independent Brazil. In 1788, Tiradentes and other like-minded individuals, including prominent figures such as Claudio Manuel da Costa and Tomás Antonio Gonzaga, formed the Inconfidencia Mineira. The aim was to establish a Brazilian republic free from Portuguese rule, with Vila Rica as the heart of this new nation. The plan was to be implemented during the Derrima, a tax collection aimed at generating public revolt. However, the conspiracy was betrayed by one of its members, Joaquim Silverio dos Reis, in exchange for tax exemption. The plot was uncovered and the movement fell apart before it even began. Tiradentes was arrested and faced a long and exhausting trial that lasted almost three years. He remained unwavering, taking full responsibility for the movement in an effort to protect his comrades. On April 23, 1792, Tiradentes was publicly hanged in Rio de Janeiro. His body was then dismembered and the parts sent to various locations in Minas Gerais as a warning to others. However, instead of instilling fear, his death planted the seeds for future rebellions. Although his life ended tragically, Tiradentes' story has not been erased. At the end of the 19th century, Republicans began to celebrate it as a symbol of resistance and freedom. After the proclamation of the Republic in 1889, the day of his execution became a national holiday and his name was immortalized in cities, streets and military regiments throughout the country. Today, Tiradentes is a national hero, an enduring symbol of Brazil's struggle for independence and self-determination. His story reminds us of the power of resilience and the persevering spirit of those who dare to dream of a better future. From his humble origins to his tragic end, Tiradentes' life was marked by courage, sacrifice and an unshakable belief in freedom. His legacy continues to inspire to this day making him a timeless symbol of Brazilian pride and resilience. Thanks for watching, and if you enjoyed this glimpse into Brazilian history, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to hear more stories about the incredible individuals who shaped our world. Stay curious, stay informed, stay tuned to Era Shapers.